Well, good evening, everybody, and we welcome you ringside. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we're just about ready for action. Texas. Manny Pacquiao's ring walk. Something special in the air. You can just sense it out of him. to him. Looks like just another day in his life. Introducing first, with a record of 52 wins, 38 by way of knockouts, and only three defeats, fighting out of General Santo. His adversary, with a record of 51 victories, 32 by way of knockout and five losses, hailing out of Philadelphia, the executioner Hawkins. Remember, guys, obey my commands at all times. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch them up. is now underway. All the talk is done. It is simply time to fight. Sending out the power shot. It was a straight left hand. Now he ties up there. Up and down, side to side. Keeps his hands up defensively, protecting the head. What are your expectations for Manny Pacquiao tonight? Well, what I always expect, first of all, that he's going to be aggressive. He's going to be friendly to the eye. A guy that you want to watch. And a guy who's going to try to get to you early on. Power puncher versus the high stamina fighter. How does the high stamina fighter want this fight to unfold as it goes along? Well, the high stamina fighter, what he wants to do is he wants to get a lead. Get the lead, go out there quick out of the gate, and then later on you have the power puncher looking for one shot at a time. He's gonna be searching them all night, and he's never gonna find them. Good job, good job. Didn't get it done going to the body there. Good block. You see him holding on. A well-placed left hand up top. Clean shot with the right. He clearly came in with a strategy here tonight, Teddy, and so many times it's, hey, I'm going to bang that drum. Yeah, he is banging that drum. That drum happens to be the body, and he figures that he's going to try to move on him, so start doing it early on, and later on he's going to have a guy in front of him. Last 10 seconds of this first round. Manny Pacquiao's ripped by an uppercut. This round comes to an end. A round in which this fighter threw a lot of punches, didn't land a lot of punches. I'll tell you, what advice can you give to him if you're the trainer? Well, first of all, deal with the psychological part. Joe, don't forget, 75% of this game is psychological. Don't let him get discouraged, because even though he's not going to say nothing, in his head he's starting to get discouraged. Just say to him, hey, listen, you're going to catch him. Let's shorten him up a little bit. And you know what? He's moving his head, so go to the body. Because now you're going to hit him a little with the body, because the body's not moving. Takes one, but gets one. Good work by Manny Pacquiao. Pacquiao's doing what every trainer wants to see their fighter do. 
Land punches and bunches. The combination lands. Bernard Hopkins' his right hand scores well. Keep your hands up. Dismisses his opponent's headshot. 90 seconds to go here in this round. Nice work, the left hand to the head. Man, that's Hopkins' his defense job. did a good, good job, job there, able to avoid that punch. Able to dismiss it. Good right hand. Targeting that hook upstairs by Manny Pacquiao. Hopkins has done a good job there, offensively scoring with that left hand. Look at that combination. I mean, solid shot to left. Wow! As elusive and difficult as Hopkins is to face, his opponent is making it look easy right there. The power shot scores the knockdown. going to keep taking this test, rising up after being knocked down. Good return fire that time. Bernard Hopkins is getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. Pacquiao's knockdown in that last round has really got his corner pumped up here. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Manny Pacquiao. Hopkins is coming out here after being knocked down in the previous round. How important is it for him to be cautious here, to make sure that he does have his legs underneath him? You know, it's a little bit of a double-edged sword there, Joe, because if you're too cautious, hey, your opponent, he reads it. You're not in that ring alone, you know, and then he's going to get more aggressive. So you want to go out there, maybe faint him a little bit. Let him think you're okay. Let him think you want to go after him. Let him think you want to engage a little bit and then wind up boxing, staying on the outside, buying some time. There you go. He's showing what a skilled fighter he is with this counter punching. Good flush, straight left hand. Good flush shot by Manny Pacquiao. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Throws a counter punch there. Would you rather have a fighter who's feared or a fighter who's fearless? I feel like I'm talking to Sonny from the Bronx Tale, but I think that I would rather have a guy that has fear because he's going to be smart all the time. He's going to be a guy that's going to be aware of things that you need to be aware of. If he's so-called fearless, he's going to walk into all kinds of things that are not going to allow him to be a fighter. Well-targeted left hand by Manny Pacquiao. Look at this, another power punch able to land. We're early on in this fight, he's going for it. Yeah, you wonder if he's got a call waiting outside. And now he brings the left hand upstairs. Work the box, work the box. That's right, box, box, box. Breathe now, deep breath, deep breath. Our first chance to take a look at Teddy's scorecard here as round number four is underway. Manny Pacquiao's in control so far, two rounds to one. Still anybody's fight. I think he's been the busier guy, though. Yeah, he has been the busier guy. And also, he's been a better real estate agent. You know, location, location, location. He's been in the right position for his style. He's been in tight. Right hand downstairs. <laughs> Unable to make an impact there by Manny Pacquiao. Pacquiao is coming through now beautifully. That's the combination punching he wants to put forth. Targeting that overhand left. Oh, what a whiff by Manny Pacquiao. Gotta see those colors. Hopkins is able to land a good, solid left hand. Well, that was his intention, and that's what he's doing. Not engaging in the fight, but clinching. And coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. Parries that punch intended for the head.
Teddy, what would you recommend based on what we're seeing here? Well, two aspirin and then, oh, oh no, actually, I would say a little counterpunching would be just what the doctor ordered. That's a better prescription for him. I like the way he went up top that time with the hook. Hopkins is able to avoid that punch. What power from that left hand of Pacquiao. Good flush shot upstairs. Good job, boy. Good job. Targeting that belt line with the right hand. Bernard Hopkins is left. Working well that time. Wow, he backs up the combination. Landed all four of them. Hopkins' productivity really dropped off in that last round. And with a lack of offense came some sloppy defense. Just look at his face now. Yeah, and you know what? He should look at his trainers, too, because I always say that about this business. Where are the teachers? Where are the trainers? He should be able to get away from punches. With his experience, he should do a better job than he's you been doing this, tonight. You got this all day, all day. Oh, and he's got something for him himself, and it's a left hand. Left to the body. Bernard Hopkins going old school there. B-hop with your basic one-two. Nice work with the uppercut. Manny Pacquiao with a big right hand. Pacquiao's doing a brilliant job with his head movement. He's employing top-notch defense right here, and it's frustrating his opponent. It is frustrating his opponent. His opponent needs to make an adjustment of thinking right now and understand what's there, not what's not there. We know that the head's not there, but what's there? The body. He needs to start going downstairs. That will freeze up some of that head movement. Hopkins, his jab can do so much there. He used it well that time. Boom, left hand comes home. Pacquiao's coming. Big, big shot he just scored with. And he goes down for a second time. Does he have enough this time to rise up and continue on? One, two, three, four, five. B Hop went down, but he's proving he's not out. Hopkins looking to fight on. Well, supposed to be fighting, but instead he's hugging. Jump on him. Nice. <laughs> to the head he goes with a left hand. Final 10 seconds of this fifth round. And this round comes to an end. Look at that swollen eye. Hopkins' eye is basically shut. Well, right now, he's got to concentrate harder than he has before, maybe than he ever has before. And he's got to make sure that he sees everything coming at him somehow, finds a way, even looking through that little slit. Brings the hook that time. Attaboy, keep swinging, baby. Bernard Hopkins is coming up with the answers, avoiding that punch. Oh, what a hook upstairs. See, Bernard Hopkins has been having those silly gym wars for so many years now that it's just second nature to throw your punches in accurate combination form. A headshot block. Oh, keep your feet moving. Oh, you see him with the left of the head there? Manny Pacquiao's blocking ability is doing well for him there. Hopkins is now switching things up. He was knocked down earlier, so now he's going to try to take a different course. Now, that tells me, if I'm his opponent, a couple of things. Either that he's very clever, that he's making a little switch, or it just gives me confidence that he's desperate. You know, he's never done this before, and in my mind, I'm saying, I got him right where I want him. And you can see he wanted to do that as he holds on there. Keep that head moving, baby. Come on, champ. Pacquiao with a good block there. Stop, stop. He 
needs to improve that accuracy. Missed with the headshot. Nice strike after catching one by Manny Pacquiao. And round six comes to an end. Hopkins' right corner field. has quite a task in front of them now. Their fighter's eye swollen shut. Right now, you have to come up with some strategy. Maybe he turns his stance around, where he leads now with a good eye. You know, right now, the good eye is back a little bit, where he can't pick up things. Maybe now, he needs to change his position in the ring, where at least his good eye is in front. Not able to land the headshot. Oh, good exchange there. How about that left hand? That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Manny Pacquiao. Oh, and he returns fire with a left hand. Scored well up top. Right to the head with that right. Pacquiao on the mark with that right hand. Good body shot. The right hand came home. Hopkins is putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp combination. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Nice block by Manny Pacquiao. Solid. How about that? from being the victim to handing out the punishment. One, two, three, four. Focus. Manny Pacquiao is going to beat the count, but he is damaged. He's going to have to find a way to kill this clock. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Manny able to block that. Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. And round seven comes to an end. Let's take a look at Teddy's scorecard as to where things stand right now. Manny Pacquiao's up. That's the good news. The bad news is this fight may end soon because of his face. Yeah, a little magic has to be done in that corner now. Keep that swelling down, stop that bleeding. Allow their fighter to do what he's doing, fight. Good defense just covering up down low. Pacquiao showing us that he is willing to stick with the game plan. But Teddy, that game plan saw him knocked down earlier in this fight. What would you be telling him? You know, in some ways, I tell him, good, because you have to go with what you have. You know, you can't completely change. That's not possible in the course of the fight. You are who you are. So it's not the game plan necessarily, Joe, or the style that's wrong. It's the execution of the game plan. That has to be done. Big shot to left. Did you see that? How is he going to survive this? Once again, he hits the deck. He's going to have to find a way. fight. Pac-Man's opponent is floored. A knockout victory. Boy, was that impressive. <laughs> Solid shots all night long by Manny Pacquiao. The last one ending things here. And now I have to say that the commission, wherever he fights next, 